Hi guys! I feel like I haven't done a tag video in so long. Maybe because I rarely get tagged. But, um, Makeup Desi and Icy Abstract tagged me to do the top six lip product tag. And so thanks for tagging me ladies. You guys are so sweet. Um, I just want to say that like I like these products just because like they work for me and I like them for different reasons and you know I'm not trying to say like oh you should get these top six so just to, just bear that in mind you'll see exactly what I mean in just a bit okay so I'm gonna start with NYX Goddess of the Night lip gloss in Sweetheart it's just a um, pretty like light pink lip gloss <laughs> I'm trying to figure out how to describe the color, but um, I don't know how to describe it. But I just feel like it's a nice neutral pink that looks good, like by itself or on top of other lipsticks. And the quality and the texture of it's pretty nice too. So yeah, I like that. I find myself wearing it a lot. And so the next one is my Rimmel Lasting Finish Lipstick in Airy Fairy. I really, really love this. I've mentioned before that it's similar to NYX for those of you, those of you who like that color or shade, it's just like a nude mauvey pink. And it's just a very flattering shade, I think, and it smells kind of good. It smells kind of sweet. I mean, like if you kept sniffing it, it might be a little nauseating, but it, I, I like it. <laughs> and yeah, that's the second one. These two would look good together. Okay, next. I don't know if lip liners count, but I like my Revlon Colorstay Lip Liner in clear. Just because, you know, you, I can throw this underneath any lipstick or lip gloss, and it's I just use it as a base sometimes to hopefully, you know, like prolong the staying power of whatever I have on my lips. So that's the third one. And then my fourth one, I kind of wanted to throw a red lipstick in there, and I really like Maybelline's Moisture Extreme Lipstick in Ruby Luster. It's just a really gorgeous red color. I find that it's kind of flattering on me and I like that it's, it feels moisturizing on the lips. So yeah, okay, next is my Prestige Wonderful Lip Plumping Gloss in Dainty. You know when I first got this I kind of expected more. Because, you know, reading reviews and stuff, I often, like, read reviews um, on products and certain shades before I buy them. You know, just to, for good measure, I guess. Um, and then, <laughs> the first time I applied this, it, like, it was such a burning sensation. I was like, oh my gosh. And it is a lip plumping product, so, I mean, I should have expected that. But after the first wear, like, it, it just started feeling like a slight tingle. It didn't, it wasn't so, you know much after a while and I, I don't know it just really grew on me and I find like I found myself using this more often than I thought I would and um, it does have like little micro glitters in it which makes it which is really pretty and the scent is like a really like a really strong spicy cinnamon scent that I didn't I wasn't too crazy about at first either but that kind of grew on me too so I don't know I, I'm throwing this in here because I find myself using it more often than I thought I would. And this is also, I use this a lot because it looks great over a dead nude lip. It just gives that amazing, gorgeous, like, peachy glow onto the nude lips, if you know what I'm saying. And okay, this one is really unconventional, this next product. But this is, I like to throw this over this. And this is just a icky old Alme concealer stick. This is supposed to be used on your blemishes and stuff. And it is not good for that. But I'm glad I just tried it out on my lips one day. Because it works really, really well. Like the lasting power is pretty decent on my lips. Especially if I, you know, put my Revlon clear lip liner underneath. And then after I, you know... Um, apply this all over my lips and apply this Rimmel lip gloss. It's like the most gorgeous <laughs> nude lip ever. I swear. So that's why this is in here, even though it's not for the lips. And that's why I was like kind of saying earlier, it works for me, but you know, 
it's probably more conventional and probably wiser to just get a good nude lipstick. But I'm weird. I like to use what I have, and yeah. So that's pretty much it. Um, I do have a list of people I want to tag. Let's pull it up here. Okay, I would like to tag Giselle Vids, Vavavoom816, Peach. She has three E's in her names, just like my name. A lot of you guys keep misspelling my username. Extiner has three E's, okay? Um, I'd also like to tag it's Liz89, and then I left the last slot open for whoever wants to do this video, because please do, just let me know, and I'll go ahead and stick your name right in there. And I'm going to put the names right over here that I tag. And so, yeah, because I don't want to exclude anyone. I know some people rarely get tagged, and you want to get tagged. And, you know, I rarely get tagged, but hey, it's cool. But yeah, if you want to do it, please just let me know. And that's it. Hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you all later. Bye.